Hello people, it's Poet, and we are in the Pokemon world, and I was just getting some apples. You can see I I learned from my good friend on the Red Cube server, a dual get, that if you tear down the swamp trees, you get a better chance of getting apples, and sure enough, I got four apples from just like four trees or something like that. So I was kind of running around here and watching all the Pokemon, watching them battle it out, and that kind of thing. And then I saw something in the distance, and we're going to go check it out. Hopefully it's still there. Might not be, but hopefully it will be. Now, where did I see it? There's in and around here. Oh. That thing drops diamonds. Okay, but I don't see what I saw. Which is a little bit disappointing. Let me look around here. In the water. I'm hoping that I find it again because it was very exciting. Well, now I'm not going to spoil what I saw because when I see one again, it won't be as as wonderful to you guys if I spoil it. Hmm. It's very upsetting. It was like literally a second ago. I turned around, looked at the apples, turned around again, and now it's completely gone. I, I just don't understand how that could be. And also, that guy is huge! Look at him! It's massive! I can't believe it! But yeah, it's basically... I know that there was a Pokemon here a second ago, and he's not here anymore. It's very disappointing. Hmm... It's very difficult to see sometimes, you know, where they might go, where they might end up. Okay. Well, whoop, excuse me. Man, you're huge. Okay, come here, Dragonair. 51, level 51? I don't think I have anybody, I don't have anybody on me that's that... High, high level, but... And the only type, type I have is a fire type, huh? I think this guy gets away for today. I could try. You know, I could at least try. Maybe I'll luck out. You know what? I'm gonna try. Come here. Okay. Least I can do is try to hit him. Maybe with, like, Dragon Rage. Although he's... What is he? Is he, like, dragon type, maybe? As well? Like, will he have some kind of a dragon immunity? I don't know. We'll see. Well. Did okay, but now I'm paralyzed. And he used dragon rush, which is an amazing attack, apparently. Dragon used... Dragon Arrow used Dragon Rush, and I fainted. But... Let's see... Aeron, if I can... If I can just hit him down a few times... Let's say with... with headbutt, maybe? Or Metal Claw? Oh, he's so... Ah! Uh, Metal Claw wasn't effective. Headbutt. No. Okay, but now, if I get the first hit... Let's use Takedown. Okay. I won! And I gained 4,143 for Shield On. Oh. My. God. Let's see this. Oh, the man. 27, 28. Ooh, ancient power. Let's see. User attacks with a prehistoric power also raises the user's stats all at once. I like that. Wow. Okay, so did he drop a diamond or anything? He was over here. 
Uh, eh, I don't think so. It's a little bit disappointing. But I just realized, with Coco fainted, the only thing I have is, is this guy, guy, this guy, to ride around on. Well, that doesn't look quite, quite right, but let's see. Oh, hard to see. We. Swimming away. This is amazing. This looks so ridiculous. I love it. I love every bit of it. Oh, I, you know what's disappointing? I run up to the edge and I can't like just run over the edge. That should be the way. But I have to jump. So that kind of makes it a little bit difficult, but... What I also don't like is that when you are riding a Pokemon like I'm doing right now, if you... Get my head out of the way. If you... I can't get through that little space. Are you kidding me? Am I trapped in here? If you encounter a wild Pokemon, uh, like say that Growlithe attacked me, it doesn't attack my Ponyta or anything like that. It attacks my Pokemon as usual. Come on. Can't see. We'll just go this way. There we go. We. It's a My Little Pony in Pokemon. Totally. Um, but yeah, it doesn't attack the Pokemon you're riding, it attacks the Pokemon uh, that you have in your slot, which is kind of, it's okay, but it's not, you know, it's not right. Look at... Oh. Ivysaur, good little Ivysaur. Just gonna take a peek around here. Ratata. Hmm. People are saying that they saw some of the other starter Pokemon. That's really cool. Uh, in the last episode that I completely missed. Here's one right here. Pichu. Is it? Wait. Do you start with a Pichu? And an Eevee. Ah. Ah. Decisions, decisions. And I only got. I guess two Pokemon, and they're both fairly high level compared to these guys. This is going to be a disaster. Okay. Eevee? Eevees are just that important to me that I can't let this guy go. I'm going to use the weaker uh, fire attack. Ooh, and it's still pretty strong. Uh, bag, Pokeball, and I've only got three Ultra Balls, so this might be a disaster. I don't know. I'm going to try right now. Throw an Ultra Ball, see what happens. Please don't break fruit. Oh, no, he broke free. Of course he broke free. Okay. What if... If I use anything again... If I just run... Okay, where did he go? Yeah. Let's try that. I hear that throwing Pokeballs out of battle catches them more often. Ah, oh, so close. Okay, where's that Pichu? Where did it go? I'd like to at least try once with the Pichu. There it is. Come here, Pichu. Ah, oh, it's so adorable. It is a door. No, come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. I want to see you. Because you're adorable. Ah, I want to screenshot it. I want to take a picture. Come here so I can take your picture. It's like that, that Pokemon game where your job was to run around and take pictures of them. It's basically what my job is now. He just wants to run away from me, though. He or she. Come here. Come here. Come here. I see all those apples over there. 
Apples. I cut down some trees here too. Uh, there he is. Come here. Come here. Ah, I couldn't take a picture. Come here. Look at me for a split second, please. This whole running away aspect, I, I can't stand. I mean, seriously. Pokemon can't wait to attack you in the in the games. And meanwhile, in this one, they all run away when you're trying to take a good picture of them. Just come here. No, just come here. This is so difficult. Don't be difficult. Aha. Uh Aha. -huh. Uh -huh. There we go. I think I got a good shot. I think. All right. Oh, yeah. I was going to try to catch it. Okay. There we go. Come on. Come on. Please, I'm begging you. I'm begging you. I caught it! There we go. There we go. I told you that sometimes it's easier to catch when you just throw it. Ah, uh, now let's see. I have to like I have to climb over this mountain, which is always a task. At one point, I was gonna make a tunnel through this mountain, and I forgot, and I got flying Pokemon, so I was like, "Well, who cares?" But it does matter; it makes difference. I'd like to still do that. I think. There we go. Eh? Could probably get through that cave. Uh, let's see. This one and this one. There we go. Hope you guys are enjoying the Pokemon episodes. Uh, again, they haven't been out for a long time. Because I've been doing other huge projects with a bunch of friends and stuff. Like the UHCs and the, the Walls Championships and stuff. and You know, that kind of stuff. But I'm going to get back to my regular series now. The Dinosaur World and the Pokemon World. And post more of them. Because that's what you guys, of course, are here to see. Uh, my only, my only thing is, and the reason why I haven't been posting them is that if I post, say, a video that really matters to me, like I post the uh, the Walls Three Beta that I played with one of the admins from the Hypixel server, nobody will watch it if I have also posted like uh, a dinosaur episode that day. Um, so it kind of you know, if I want to get my other videos some attention, I gotta hold off on the ones that everybody loves. Just because that is massive. Look at you, you freak of nature. You're giant. It's amazing. Oh wow. Hmm? I was like riding on top of it for a second. That is amazing. I love that. Love it. I love the really super small and the really super huge Pokemon in this world. Because it's just so, you know, it's so weird and bizarre and not normal and makes it unique. Makes it unique in several ways. Alright, but we got a Pichu. So what I'm going to do is grab it from the computer, pull it onto the bar, and then we'll get a really good picture of it. We'll all get to see what it looks like up close. Okay. Pichu, it's the cute little Pikachu clone. Okay, where is it? Would have been on the first page, wouldn't it have been? I completely passed it up a few times now. There it is. Boop. Okay, and it looks like... Look at me. Come here and look, look at me. Okay. I control you now. I'm your master. Obey. Obey. Please. I want to get a good shot here. There we go. Adorable. Adorable. I love every bit of it. And what is it? It's a... Uh, it is a boy. And... 
the summary is as such. It's a level 12. Oops. And its stats are like that. That's a that's pretty high speed already for level 11. Uh, it's a bold natured coffee. <laughs> coffee always comes in bold if you didn't know. Well, the coffee I drink. So that might be, you know what, that'll be its name. I don't know why, but that'll be its name. Let's see where do I where do I go here? Coffee. Coffee the Pichu. The bold natured coffee. That's hilarious. That is hilarious to me. I'm sorry, but I'm like I'm beaming right now. I'm just <laughs> Oh, wow. You are wicked looking, too. I've got to admit. I mean, you should be pretty proud of how you look. Hey, coffee. <laughs> Love it. Okay, well, I think we're going to end the episode here. Um, I wish I could have caught that Eevee, but I need to make a lot more Pokeballs. The reason I got all these apples uh, and I got gold with it so that I can kind of make a, a rare candy. I've got all the supplies for a rare candy here. I need to get a little bit more glowstone, perhaps. But I can make quite a few more rare candies. My Magikarp is still level 18, so I'm going to level it up to 19. Uh, and then we'll do something crazy with the rare candy, and we'll show you what that is in the next episode. <laughs> so we'll be seeing you there in the Pokemon world. Like this video if you liked it, subscribe if you haven't already, and do all those other awesome things that you people do. Bye-bye.